Hey guys, it is Saturday afternoon. It's been all week since I have videoed last and <laughs> here's a little face you guys haven't seen in a really long time. This is my little cloth baby Petunia. That would be fun because people ask if I still have her so I thought oh well we'll just do a little video with her in it so they know she still exists. She's still here. She's hanging out in the swing. I actually put um, a little snowsuit on her. It's actually a snowsuit I got from Danny when we did our box trade. And it's a teeny, teeny, tiny, tiny, tiny. Look at the size of this. It's tiny. So like a little itty bitty miniature size preemie snowsuit. <laughs> I fit her perfect. So I went ahead and put her in it. So I just wanted to kind of update you guys with what's going on because I haven't been on a lot. I haven't been doing as many videos as I was and I just wanted to let you know that it's just because I'm busy. I've got a lot going on. Um, back to school organizing of kids and just getting schedules worked out has been quite the task. <laughs> and of course work has been really busy and very tiring so yeah I just haven't had as much time or I've just been flat out tired when I get home so I haven't really um, had the urge to want to make a video in a little bit so um, also I am on the lookout and this will probably shock many because um, you know I talked in many videos about, you know, Romy Stridum babies not being really for me. And most of them aren't, but I have a couple that I really like. And um, I'm actually on the lookout for a Lennox Stridum. That's why I'm talking about it here, because I know that many people may see this video. And if you hear of anybody that wants to part with theirs at any point in time, I would be very interested in adopting one. And like I said, I have mentioned that, you know, I, you know, the past Romy dolls that I have had weren't my cup of tea and they weren't, but not every doll that, you know, Claire Taylor has made has been my cup of tea either. And same with any artist, um, you know, it's it's really about the baby, and like I have also said in my other videos, I think that Romy Stridum is an absolutely brilliant artist. Um, I just haven't hadn't found the perfect baby of hers for me, but Lennox truly speaks to me, so that is why if one happens to come across my path then I know it's meant to be if she never comes across my path and is never available then then she wasn't meant to be but I am on the lookout so if any of you out there watching know anybody that eventually may want to part with hers or does currently you can please contact me because I'd be very interested in bringing one home and um, yeah that's pretty much it been raining here all day <laughs> so it's very dreary and it's turned very cold so we had like li literally 40 degree evenings with a high of maybe mid 50s and then add rain to it and it makes for a pretty rotten crappy day <laughs> which also makes me kind of I don't know depressed oh, I have no idea but anyways trying to get a lot done this weekend um I don't know how successful I'll be at it the weekend to groom my puppies, which you may hear barking in the background because I locked them out of the front area of the house and they're just ticked off that they can't get to where I am because <laughs> I wanted them to be quiet for a little bit. And they've been super playful this afternoon and they get barking when they play. Um, but um, yeah, got to groom the puppies tomorrow. So that's on my list of chores along with the regular house stuff, and that takes a few hours. So, well worth it, though, because they turn out very pretty. And they stay nice and un untangled and all that. But um, I haven't had a whole lot of time to play with babies, although I come in and peek at them and make sure they're all good, and it's just nice knowing that they're in here and safe. And um, hopefully, you know, like I said in a previous video, once things get settled, with the kids back in school and it's more of a routine um, 
hopefully things will settle down and I'll have more time to play with babies and do more videos. And um, you guys will see me more frequently. So, but I'm alive. I'm still here and doing well. Um, my friend Tina is still in Florida as we speak. I haven't even had a chance to talk to her a whole lot. So I have to catch up with her. I know she's enjoying her trip thoroughly. And um, yeah, so I'm looking forward to chatting with her. And uh, that's about it. So I hope everybody enjoys their weekend and hopefully I'll have some time to do another video before the weekend's over. So I will see you all soon, guys. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.